Hello everyone, in today's video, I will show you how I was able to run ads again on Facebook after having my account permanently restricted from advertising. You see right here that, let me just go back one page, what was restricted was my Facebook user. I have submitted a review, but it was rejected on November 22nd. This is their final decision. And I can't use or manage ad accounts. I can't create or run ads. I can't manage advertising assets or people for businesses. My disabled assets are personal ad account and audiences. And that prevents me from running ads for basically anyone. And here, it's me with another account running ads again. So in order for you to start running ads again, you need an email address. As long as you haven't used this email before, you need a phone number, which you can get from Skype. And you pay $3.99 per month, and you can get a Skype number. And you can see here that on the 23rd, the day I created my account, I received the confirmation code. And the day I joined my first business manager, he asked me to enable two-factor authentication. This is the code I have received from Facebook. Now I'm able to run ads again. Um, but what you have to keep in mind is that if you do not have another admin on your business manager, you won't be able to recover those assets. And you can even use this as a contingency plan. And what I did when I created the account was post a few things. You can see, this is my activity log. It goes from November 29th until November 23rd. When I created my account, I uploaded a profile picture, a cover photo. I put some information, some like reasonable real information. I have followed a few pages, commented on a few things. Um, posted more a uh, few days, created a business page with a profile of a content creator, uploaded a few videos. You can record videos at home of anything. And on the 29th is when I had access to all the business manager accounts that I have right now. There's still a few ones that I haven't sent the invite yet. I had to, I have to have someone else sending those invites for me. But now I'm perfectly able to run ads again. And this could be a contingency plan. Just create an account, follow these instructions, have your profile ready because this could happen to anyone. And I see a lot of people buying accounts from Fiverr or from other people on communities, but you don't have to do that. And don't forget about the phone. The phone is very important. It doesn't have to be through Skype. On Skype is where I was able to receive the SMS notifications. I've tried a few apps online, a few websites to receive SMS, but it did not work out. But with Skype, I was able to receive all the SMS notifications and type the codes. Okay. Uh, that's it. I'm making this video just to show everyone that there's life after being permanently banned from Facebook advertising. And you don't have to spend money on Fiverr buying new accounts. If you'd like to know anything more, you can comment on the video. And you can also just email me at lucas.odentus at gmail.com. If there's anything that I didn't make it clear, just let me know and I'll help you. I'll be glad to. That's it.